So I had this idea the other day because I'm not used for a whole lot here. <laughs> I, I'm still learning um, a lot. Yeah, we learned but, today. Yeah, we learned today. <laughs> I, I screwed up with the spray paint. Um, Travis had never used a rattle can before. No, I had, but usually just to paint vulgar things. So I he never, had, like, but not to. Something. Oh, you were a graffiti kind of guy. Yeah. No, no, nothing that I. Nothing that. I wasn't allowed to do that. Oh. Did you draw yeah. a wiener on something? Yeah, definitely. So people have hired you to paint murals. <laughs> no, that. it's more just been like fucking around with my buddies. Hey, here's some spray paint and here's this. Let's spray paint something on it. But anyway, that's not the point. Sorry, yeah, what was your idea? One of the things I have been used for here is Landon has a bad habit of getting flustered uh, when backing a trailer. It and, has happened a time or two. And I have to bail him out because for those of you who don't know, um, back in the day, I drove a yard truck at a distribution center, so I spent a good portion of my day going backwards with a trailer. Made a living doing it. Yeah, made a living doing it. And uh, so the other day, Landon uh, did not want to back up a trailer, and we had Seth hop in the van. And Seth, I viewed Seth as a guy who have no problem. I don't have problem. Let me set this stage. Okay. Brother. Brother. No, let me set this stage. Okay. Okay. Robert Took out the Huffman. whole fire bed. Ro- yeah, well, okay, Rob doesn't need a 100-yard-long flower bed in the middle of the driveway. But you but, won't tell him that. Well, yeah. 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 You're right. yeah. You're that? I won't tell Rob that. You're right. <laughs> I guess I kind of just did if he listens to yeah. this dumb shit. But, so anyway, <laughs> single lane around the flower bed. So you have a single lane between the house and the flower bed. So where you needed to pull up to set yourself, Rob's new purchased pickup truck was sitting there. I asked Landon, hey, man, keys in it? Nope, nope, don't have the keys. All right. So I try to pull up beside the house. Well, I can't get close enough to the house without hitting the house, so I'm on the bricks of the flower bed, which they made a big deal out of. But if you look around this flower bed, it looks like we had a drunk Daytona 500 around the flower bed. If I had a dime for every... Thing that every little concrete thing that fell off of that damn oh, flower yeah. bed, we'd be millions. Oh yeah. Well, if I had a dime for every time they want to sit around and make fun of somebody else, but not volunteer to jump in and do it themselves. I did. I did. Okay. Seth. I came up to the driver's side window and I said, "Do you want me to do this?" Yeah, but yeah, and then you got mad. No. Yeah. <laughs> okay. And he got mad at me for asking. <laughs> do but you once, know why once, we were laughing? Once we got Rob's truck moved because the keys were in it, I got it in there no problem. I think your approach was all wrong. Yeah, you, you were all you even with that truck there. If you'd have just from where it was parked to begin with, if you'd have just driven straight towards the backyard, you'd have had enough room to at least angle the trailer where you need it, and then point the van towards the house, and then you'd have had a straight shot. Maybe, but I didn't view it that way as I came up the driveway. Yeah, <laughs> and I thought when when we were debating on who would do it, and I was like, Seth's got it. I thought Seth was seeing it the same way I was seeing it. And when he'd made that turn to go around the flower bed and by the house, I said, oh, dear God, well, this is not going to be easy. Yeah, no, I mean, it wasn't. So anyway, during while we were watching Seth back up and go forward and back up and go forward and take out some bricks, <laughs> I said, you know what we need? We need a trailer backing combine because I feel like I have pretty good experience doing it. Landon has let me do it a time or two, and I've always bailed him out. I've seen RJ do a good job. I have witnessed Seth back the trailer up at the shop hey, and do a fine I have, job. I have done, I have done a lot You've more this better. year. This I year, I, I did. We sat in Josh Rayum's parking lot one day for about 30 minutes. That's because it looked like a bomb went off inside and out, but that's a different story. <laughs> anyway. God, don't get frustrated. <laughs> we want to do this combine, and every time I bring up somebody having a having trouble backing <laughs> up a trailer, they just get mad at me. We do need different types of trailers. Yes. That will make a difference in the results. The smaller trailers are harder. The big enclosed ones are easier. We go to a parking lot somewhere with some cone. RJ had the idea to get some cones and like set up some scenarios, some obstacles, maybe even do like the... Between the cones, driving forward. We could do a little snake action. Um, and just see who can do things. We, we'd have to do points for time and then points for quality, I think, as well. I agree. So who are our judges going to be? Should we have judges out there? Yeah, I mean, um, should I compete? Yeah, I yes. Okay. Should Maybe should Rob could be a judge. I don't yes, think Rob he's... That's a horrible idea. Yeah, that's probably not good. He wouldn't. He, I don't think Dad he would, would even throw his arms up and walk off. Yeah, he wouldn't even commit enough time to even stand out there. That'd probably be the only. Maybe time we just have we like really a, have enough time to actually do this. Maybe we just yeah. have a. I don't think we'll it would take that long. Time. Maybe we just have a scoring system and then we sit down and score it. It'd be biased though. 
I'm going I'm, I'm to give myself all A's, all 100. Well, well, if you look like an idiot out actually, there, you can't give yourself all 100s. Well, I mean, you have to have, you, I mean, you got to have somebody to run the stopwatch. We, yeah, we could just do no, no uh, affiliation with any single one of us. Time and deduct points for cones hit, maybe, or, yeah. or something like that. Either way, I'd really like to do that because that's obviously an area we're struggling at. We could we're use a lot of help in that department, yeah.